it's Monday the 19th. That gives me seven, that gives me eight days to get the website up and running to the point where people could actually go on there and buy a product. <laughs> It's Monday evening. I was hoping to get out here in the morning, but that didn't happen. So I'm coming out here in the evening, get a few things done, and for a bit of an update on where I'm up to with the furniture business. Last week I put out a video saying that I was gonna have the furniture website and everything up and running by February 27. I don't really know why I thought that would be a good idea because the days are ticking by and I have a lot of things to do before that can actually happen. Other things that I'm gonna be doing is registering or buying a domain for the name for the furniture brand. Now I've got a name that I think I'm gonna use. If by the time I release this video I've bought the domain, I will put the name of the furniture brand in now. But this is really cool for me. I mean, it's I'm working alone. To do this, I'm creating the products, working on the workshop on my own, which I very much enjoy, but making this content and documenting the process of starting this you know, business, I guess, and furniture brand, is, uh, is, fun, is fun for me, actually. It's, uh, it stops me feeling so alone. Every so often, if I get a new subscriber or a comment, it's, uh, it's nice, I'm enjoying it. I, I'm kind of a private person, but having a, a little bit of interaction around this is good. It keeps me pushing on, makes me feel a little bit accountable. If you've watched any of these videos or you subscribe to the channel or you left a comment, then uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's having an impact. I appreciate it. So making the products is something that I find easy to be motivated to do. But the thing I have the problem with is the other things that are not the hands-on physical stuff, like the website, anything that involves sitting at a computer, really. I find that very hard to get done. I've got a box for the products that I made in the previous videos and they're almost ready to go. They need a little bit of a clean up still. I'm gonna take them into the kitchen and get them out of the box, have a little count up, see how many I've got, see how they turned out. And uh, I need to do that really just to keep moving towards getting them ready so that when I do get the website up and running, hopefully on the 27th, that they're actually fully finished and ready to send out. products in there that I've made so far. There's, I think I've got a few more scattered around that I've been using for various things like photographs and so on. I'm gonna have a big roundup, maybe tomorrow, maybe tomorrow's video, and have a count up of how many I've got of each piece. <clears throat> if you've got any thoughts or comments on the name, good or bad, 
I'm, uh, I'm curious to hear what they are. Uh, the name Stain, I'm not going to be I'm not going to change it, at least for now. Uh, I think it's more important for me just to get going, get the website up and running. I was procrastinating over the name for days and, and weeks actually, just thinking, oh, this is no good. I need to think of a new name and just going round and round. I think the reality is, in my mind at least, is that if the product's good and the service is good and the brand's good, then the name is not gonna matter so much. Uh, it's more about the quality of the, the brand and the products. So I figure the name is, is not gonna impact the business that much. Uh, but I like it, I like the name. Okay, that's gonna be it for this video. Not a huge amount happened. I'm just doing a little bit of an update so that you can stick with me through the process because there are days when I'm in the workshop doing all the crafting of the wood and it's, uh, it's very eventful. But then to get this furniture brand started and, and then to create something with that, there are gonna be lots of days where, where it's not so eventful. And now I need to take some photographs for the website of these products so that they can be displayed on there. My photography skills are not very good at all. Uh, I think they are in my head. I think, oh, I can make a good image of this. And then I take the photographs and they look average to poor, I'd say. I'm gonna do a deep dive into product photography uh, on YouTube. I'll just watch a ton of YouTube videos about how to do good product photography. And hopefully I'll get somewhere to the point where I have some photographs good enough for the website. That's gonna be it for today. I've made a little bit of progress. I've got the products rounded up. I've got a domain and the name registered for the furniture brand. And, uh, and that, that's it, I mean, it's good progress. I've mentioned it already, but the giveaway video is on the channel now. And if you go to the channel and find that video, you just have to subscribe to the channel and leave a comment on that video and then you automatically qualify for that free prize draw, which is happening next Monday, which I believe is one day before the website should be active. So that's happening next week. We've got the prize giveaway on, I believe, the 26th of February. And then the following day, the website should be live and ready to go. It might push all the way up to midnight on the 27th, I imagine, but we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching this video. I'll be doing another one tomorrow with a little bit more of an update and the next bit of progress on this project.